Oh man, it was good to be out here. I thought we got a lot of stuff accomplished. Uh, this is day 15 right here, last day of it. And uh, I'm really pleased with, with the guys' effort. Um, uh, I thought we flew around and we've made plays on both sides of the ball. The spring game happened, what did you see from the team on both sides? Well, I think the first thing that stood out was the crowd. I mean, it was an amazing crowd out here. Uh, a lot of the former players were here, man. It was good to see a, a lot of those guys come out and support. Um, from, and from all sports. Uh, but as far as spring game was concerned, a um, lot of scoring, high scoring game. <laughs> high scoring. I thought, like I said, on both sides of the ball, we made some plays. Um, I think defensively, we've got to improve in the red zone. We gave away too many, uh, too many scores in the red zone. But uh, we still have a few guys out, and hopefully we'll get them back soon. But uh, it was good to see these younger guys get a lot of reps and, and, and quality reps. A lot of schools call their spring game their junior day or something like that. Coach, time for the, the next crew to step up. What have you seen from the guys who are going to be stepping up? Well, first of all, really the coaches. <laughs> We've got quite a, new, quite a few new coaches on staff here, so uh, they got to step up. But uh, we did, like I said, a lot of young guys did get a, a bunch of quality reps. Um, uh, you know, we, we got a, a couple new running backs in here and got an opportunity to see what those guys could do. And uh, I've been really pleased with that group right there. Coach, offensively, what have you seen from the Eagles squad? And what have they taken some steps forward? Well, I think, you know, the guys that we know are players have, have really continued to improve. Uh, Pee Wee, our quarterback, is, is, is still growing and maturing. Uh, I thought uh, Trey Pratt had probably the best spring. Um, I mean, he, he's, he's electrifying and, and he can take the top off. Um, and then the running backs. Again, I thought you know we lost a couple of running backs last year to graduation, and uh, the young guys that we had out here this this the spring uh, has have been a pleasant surprise. And then defensively, we saw the defense getting credit for a few sacks during the spring game. D line seemed to have stepped up. What have you seen from them? Yeah, my offensive coach was getting on me, saying I blew the whistle a couple times a little early. <laughs> but um, I, I think our, our D line uh, coach Cord, our new defensive coordinator, has come in and uh, he's gotten a lot, got them going. He's kind of a little fire up under him and. and those guys are really playing hard, and I've really been pleased uh, with the growth from that group as well. Special teams, Coach, you were involved there as a player. You always want to see them do well, especially in the games. How they perform for you so far this spring? We're still working on the, uh, the consistency part of it all. You know, I, I still lose some sleep uh, from losing South Carolina by, by three points. So uh, I'll never be pleased with a kicking game until we are <laughs> 100. So good group of guys. Uh, Again, just working on consistency, and uh, when they're hitting the ball, you know, they got strong legs. We just have to be consistent with our technique and fundamentals. And Coach, briefly earlier you had talked about some of the new coaches. What have you seen from them, and how are they contributing, and how's it been for them settling in to this Eagle, uh, this Eagle area? We, we've, it felt like camp because we've been putting a lot of hours in. Uh, I think, I think the, the staff got hired probably the week before we started spring ball. So it's been some late nights and some early mornings. Uh, but we have a good group of new coaches here. I'm really pleased with, with their knowledge and how they've adjusted to the young men and how our student athletes have accepted coaching. All right, Coach, any last words you'd like to say to the Eagle fans? Oh, man, uh, I love you guys. Thank you so much for your support. Uh, we're going to finish up strong in the classroom. Uh, make sure these academics are in place, and, and we'll be ready to kick this thing off come August.